Hey guys, this is the Kerfix, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Mardak Chapter 2. In the last episode, it was just... We got a ton of, um... Got a ton of stuff out of the way, like a ton of treasure chests, and in this episode, we're going to explore the Eastern Glens in order to find Kanoya. So, hey, we found a tre and we found a battle right off the bat, too. So we got, obviously, new enemies, because we're entering a new area, and let's see if they're awake to grow. Electricity. Uh, he resists electricity. All right, so I'm just gonna use electricity. That's usually what the that's usually the spell I use in this area, anyways. Uh, Mardek, let's try your attack. Hmm, not too bad. Let's try power slash. And who was weak against Earth? Oh, oh no, what? Wait, what? Oh, Kanoma was weak against Earth. <laughs> Yeah, that's what that new one looks like. It's especially good against water enemies, which you will be finding a couple during this uh, game. Oh, and I forgot to show something. Leanna can actually attack with her wand, but it doesn't do... It doesn't... It wouldn't do damage in the sense that you'd see, so I'm here. I'll show you. Okay, well, she could just miss entirely, too. That's pretty cool. Oh, Marty, you get the finishing blow. You're a little low on XP. Although, I should probably make Emma do some fighting. I don't know. Uh, I haven't mentioned this up until now, but I have some special plans for the weekend. Uh, that being on that's and the um, the plans I have are going to be updated every Saturday and Sunday. So you will have to. All right, I got a uh, poison stinger in that battle. Let's give that to Marduk. So now they all have equal defenses. Um, yeah, Marduk is learning that. And these ones, um, I haven't mentioned yet, but these passive skills, they, um, go up one ability point over, uh, over here. They go up one of these every single battle you do. So it only take 11 more battles for Marduk to, uh, bring you learn agility plus one. So yeah. And I got a new item there. It's a poison stinger right here. It's just more potion stuff. So let's see if I like that. And I'm, I'll wait for I'll wait to heal with Marduk. And I always wonder what what was the purpose of this rock? Maybe it was just here to make the look path look cool, but you can't examine it or anything. Um, like you can't get an item from it. Forty-four gold. Not how much gold do we actually have? Where is that? Oh, one thousand two hundred thirty-seven. That's actually not bad. And we have enough. And do and learn damage minus twenty percent. So, so I'm going into my menus so often, but does he have anything else he could use? Nope. And I still have yet to, um, have Marduk. Oh yeah, I forgot Duke and got poisoned in the last battle. These, those wasps are very, very annoying. And, uh, in the, in the battle I just learned, I, I completely missed their resistances, and I, I used Earth Slash on them, and I completely got zero damage. Oh okay, god, excuse me. As soon as I come out from battle, I burp, of course. Because that's typical, I suppose. Not, probably not. Uh, battle. Alright, um, just one question I'd like to ask you guys. Just kind of like a, uh, commenter's question of the day, I guess. Um, do you guys like that I'm cutting out a lot of battles? Because, um, I could show you my fighting skill. Or my, not my skill, I'm not really that. I'm not really talented about. I'm not really talented about or in fighting in this game, but I guess you could. Um, I guess you could call it my fighting style. Uh, as as far as um, how I like when I use attacks and how I heal and such. I don't, I don't really know, but um, yeah. There we go. A, a commenter's question of the day: Would you like me to cut less battles, or would you like to? Oh, Emily mastered uh, magic damage plus twenty. But yeah, would you like to? Would you like me to cut less battles, or even maybe cut more battles? Or well, no, I, I already cut pretty much all the battles I could. The only battles I really could cut would be would be boss battles, and that would be a bad idea. I would not like to cut boss battles. Okay, so I've just run up. Well, I didn't run out of magic, but I'm getting pretty close to running a lot of magic with Liana here. You see, she's got twelve magic left. So an alternative you can use um, to gain magic back rather than just using 
mana berries, uh, because they are far and few in between, or few and far in between, uh, you can just attack with them. Of course, every time I try to show it, it just misses. God dang it. Um, okay, let's show you just one more round here. Okay, there we go. See, she gained 10, 10 mana back there when she did 10 damage. So basically, the amount of damage that she does um, is equal to the amount of mana she gains. Um, and someone leveled up? Yeah, Leanne leveled up, that's what I thought. But yeah, that's pretty much all. So, yeah, as I was saying before, bad idea to cut up boss battles because they are important to the story progression, obviously. Um, and ooh, an earth rod. Um, so that's, as you can see, a better weapon for Lana. It also does more damage, I guess. Um, and it teaches her, it teaches her a new ability, which is, um, Stone Explosion. Um, however, if you go over and look at her skills here, she has not yet mastered bubbles. So, if she takes off the, this rod, I'll show you. She takes off this rod, um, which gives her bubble and magic damage plus 20%, and give her the stone rod. And if you go back up to her skills, you see the bubbles grayed out. Now she can't use bubble. However, because she mastered damage plus 20%, she can use that. So kind of, do you guys kind of see how that works there? It's gonna, oh my god, I'm just gonna put this back on just for the sake of putting it back on, so I can master Bubble because Bubble fairly good attack. Okay, and I'm back. Um, and I'm gonna continue cutting battles until you guys in the comments tell me that um, you would not like to for me to cut battles as much. But I'm yeah, for now I'm gonna keep on cutting up battles. We're gonna have a little cutscene here. Hey, uh, Emma, how are you feeling? Hmm? Oh, I'm alright. Why do you ask? Oh, I was, I was just concerned. You seem really distressed last night after, uh, what happened. Do you think you'll be okay with this mission? I mean, it might con include killing. Yeah, I've come to terms with it, I think. I realize now that killing people who put themselves at risk of death, but, and who act in such a way to encourage it and make others feel bad, isn't such a bad thing. No, ultimately it's a good thing, because of how many people benefit from it. Innocence, though. That's the evil. If someone's done nothing, and is a good person, there's no reason to kill such a person. Not ever. Well, obviously, but what these, well, with, with what these villains do, which it, it's, but that's what these villains do, which is why it's okay to kill them for it. And if you try to change them, then you can. It's like trying to change their element. That can happen, because it's a fundamental part of the soul. The most fundamental part. I suppose, still killing a killer, it's just, a killer killer is still a killer. <laughs> Huh? That's, that's what I'm saying, Nardak, jeez. Well, let's not talk about that and get back to what we have to do, okay? To Kanoya. Alright, let's go. That was kind of a interesting cutscene. Right? Okay, I think my party's... I think my party's due for a heal. There we go. Uh, I'll do one more. There we go. Dugan's got a lot of health. He'll survive. Uh, we're coming up on a... Uh, on a crit... On a... Okay, I'm back. And, um... Jeez, oh, what... My computer decided that, um, jeez, if I could go five seconds without, um, without me getting into a battle, um, my computer decided to, uh, get low on power, uh, just as I was finishing this video, because it's almost done. Yeah, so as I was saying, videos are almost ended, as you can probably see from the time. Um, I didn't hear. Let's go save myself really quick. And, uh, what's this? It's locked type with a keyhole. With the right key, you'll be able to get through. Hmm. Maybe we'll have to come back here when we have the right key. But yeah, as I said, my computer is crapping out, and, um, well, it's not really crapping out, but, um, my computer decides to run low on power. But, yeah. Uh, we got Lake Quirr, so, is there a save crystal right here? No. Um, I'm gonna just end it here, so yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode when we continue this dialogue. See you all later.